1972 Volkswagen bus converted to electric. So that's the exterior. Let's take a look at the interior. You can go check out earlier videos and see what it looked like before. This is the after. And of course, we have the components that we put underneath the uh, polycarbonate. It's the rear battery box right there with the sticker on it. We have the engine bay. This is the plug for the trickle charger that's hanging down there. You can clip it off to the side if you like and in fact we'll do that for the filming here so there's our 12 volt auxiliary battery you see the inertia switch just poking up there KSI relay with your KSI fuse terminal strips main contactor shunt throttle inverter cooling system reservoir main disconnect 3.3 kilowatt charger DC to DC converter so there you have it the completed package So that's uh, the completed setup, what it looks like now. So we got a little bit of footage of it running. But I wanted to show you something, or I wanted you to listen to something. So what we have is, uh, turn it on here. vacuum pump so with it in neutral and this thing is really super sloppy so in neutral give it the throttle we can hear a noise okay now watch when I put in the clutch. No noise. Clutch out. Noise. Reverse. No noise. forward after we first switch it back to forward no noise and then it starts so I don't know something to do with the input shaft or what it is but something with the transaxle and since this was received with no engine in it 
you know, so we weren't, didn't drive it beforehand, did not know that there was an issue with the transaxle. So we limited our driving around uh, just to to program things, set the regen, that type of thing. So other than that, uh, she's ready to go. This is um, uh, the um, indicator that lets you know it's on. It's also you press that in, that's the coast. So if I press that in now, set it out, back to regen. And of course, over here, you saw this one, that's reverse. And the JLD 404, which monitors our pack voltage, our amp hours, and our, our amps in and out. So what's drawing now, that's just the uh, DC to DC converter draw and of course there's our uh, Curtis 840 display it just shows us RPMs amps volts this is at the inverter motor temperature controller temperature minimum voltage maximum amps back to RPM okay